how to mount the Firehouse Technology Arc and Arc 2 in the Mavic 2 Pro and Zoom that coming up right after this. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, first, we want to talk about uh, strobes and why you should use them on your drone. Um, if you are a Part 107 a commercially licensed pilot, uh, drone pilot, uh, and you have a nighttime flight waiver to fly at night, one of the requirements that you need is to be able to see your drone and other aircraft be able to see your drone from three nautical miles. The best way that I've found to do that is um, with these uh, strobes. These are by Firehouse Technology. These are the ARC. Uh, this is the tri-colored strobe and then this is the ARC 2 which is a uh, comes in uh, single colors from uh, white, red, green, and blue. Um, and then uh, once you have those on, these are all self-contained. They have their own small LiPo battery pack. Um, the batteries last five, six hours, thereabouts. And with these strobes, uh, you, they, they will meet that requirement to be able to see your drone uh, from three nautical miles. I've personally th flown uh, two miles away without any issues um, until I actually uh, was uh, getting a little sketchy video signal so decided to come back but um, these will meet that requirement so um, some people have mounted their strobes uh, with velcro that's that works okay um, it's a little iffy in my opinion but um, you know they uh, they tend to be slightly loose and I, I don't like that so uh, one of the things we've been doing for all the past drone models is uh, creating mounts for them um, now we have mounts for uh, these arc and arc 2 that we've mentioned we also have them for the flytron line for the uh, strobe on Cree and the strobe and the uh, standalone strobe that they have um, also for the firehouse technology arc uh, that which is these guys as well as the firehouse technology single Cree and dual Cree models so um, you can uh, take a look at the description at the link in the description below um, I'll have links to all these different strobes as well as to our mounts so um, let's get down to it how we mount to the new Mavic 2 Pro and Mavic 2 Zoom um, we'll talk specifically about the Arc and Arc 2 but um, the uh, process is similar for the uh, the smaller strobes as well. So um, we have these available for uh, the rear arms as well as the front landing feet. And um, so this is what the front landing foot mount looks like. And then here is the one for the rear arms. So we'll start off by mounting one of the rear arms. Uh, all you need to do is grab your strobe, and these are very, uh, they're made out of a rubberized uh, 3D print, printed filament, so they'll uh, bend around and they won't scratch your drone or anything like that. But all you need to do is just simply pry this top catch away and then slide it straight down in. That top catch springs back, keeps it in place, won't go anywhere. Um, once that's done, uh, easiest way to uh, get it on your drone itself is to uh, start on top, just slide these apart a little bit and then just rotate it down in place. Now these are actually designed to be almost all the way down to where uh, the the motor is. Um, these kind of taper down and if we uh, created them with a larger opening they could essentially slide. So what we did we made them to fit down here toward the very bottom. So that's how the uh, rear one mounts. And then to do the uh, front one, we'll just grab one of these front ones. These uh, front mounts are, are handed, so you have a right and left. You can kind of see how they're angled, um, so they appear level when they're installed. Um, so this one being angled this way will go on this front right foot. And this one being angled this way will go on the front left foot. And uh, so I'll just grab another arc strobe here. Again, bend the catch away, slide it down in place. That springs back 
and then all you need to do is slide this straight on it's friction fit right on there and you can slide this up and down where you feel you need you want it if you want to have this front LED display you can slide it down toward the bottom of the foot um, if you're not as concerned about that you can push it all the way up that is your decision so that's how that one's mounted and then just uh, repeat the steps for the other strobe mounts um, so then to get the uh, strobe out of the mount we'll pull this one off all you have to do again is pry this catch away and it slides right out so um, it's that easy uh, the mounts are available in various colors. Um, the dark gray that you'll find on the website matches the, the Mavic body perfectly. Um, we also have them in light gray, red, black, and also a clear. Um, the clear one isn't crystal clear like, uh, like you might think. It is probably maybe 70% opaque uh, just because of the 3D printing process. Um, it, uh, it makes it more of an opaque because you see a lot of the internal structure and that sort of thing. So uh, just keep that in mind when ordering. And um, you can purchase these in uh, different setups. You can purchase a single front or single uh, rear mount. You can purchase a pair of rear mounts, a pair of front mounts, or you can purchase them all um, as one set. Um, there are, uh, is, is a discount structure for uh, purchasing them together. So um, again, I will leave the link in the description below for that. And uh, if you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below or hit the contact us on our web page and I will answer you right back. And uh, if you like this video, guys, please like it and subscribe. I really appreciate it. That uh, will keep you informed on any new uh, things that we have coming out. And as always, guys, fly safe.